Based on well-known principles of hydrodynamics, Regal Marine's fast track hull uses what is called a step, an indentation in the hull bottom, to introduce air under the boat to enhance performance at planing speeds. This underwater video was supplied by Regal Marine and it dramatically demonstrates how Regal's fast track hull design works to provide greater fuel efficiency and higher speeds. Here, we see a Regal fast track hull moving slowly through the water, far too slowly to create a vacuum in the step. Note that relatively few air bubbles appear under the hull. In this frame, we can see the step, which is totally immersed in water. With the same hull running at speed, the step creates a vacuum that sucks air in from both side vents. The air fills the groove in the step, then bleeds it out aft, creating a blanket of bubbles. Now, let's look at that video again to see exactly what is happening. As the boat moves through the water, a vacuum is created in the step in the bottom of the hull. The vacuum pulls air from above the water's surface through the vent in the boat's port and starboard chines. That air is pulled in and fills the step. Then, as the boat moves forward, the bubbles stream aft, creating a carpet of air that greatly reduces drag in this part of the boat. The hull's reverse chines and lifting strakes also suck air in from the bow of the boat thus reducing drag still further and giving the boat lift. Finally, and most importantly, the boat's dynamic lift is generated by three smaller planing surfaces rather than by one large surface, which has much more wetted surface and drag. All of this makes Regal Fast Track boats easier to push so that they can use smaller engines which, in turn, saves fuel. With the same size engines, they can go faster than conventional hulls, all things being equal. Based on our tests of many different brands and models over the years, this is a concept that works. For BoatTest.com, I'm Captain Steve. We'll see you on the water.